B A S Dry Dock. Yeah, I know it sounds dirty. <laughs> But a dry dock is something that can be flooded so a load can be floated in. Actually, that sounds dirty too. <laughs> um, dry docks are used to build, maintain, or repair ships and boats. Uh, now it makes sense, right? BAS Dry Dock is a scale model builder and ships are his specialty, particularly aircraft carrier models. But he builds other scale models. Some of these models have such detail, it can take several months just to finish one project. That takes a lot of patience or insanity. <laughs> he also does mail calls and group build projects. He builds military models, showing honor and respect for those who serve their country. He builds the most realistic and accurate representations he possibly can. The final product is always a work of art. No? <laughs> okay, but they are always a piece of something. For those of you who aren't fans of scale models, BAS Dry Dock breaks up the monotony of model videos with Blaze, the Cocker Spaniel. Arf, arf! Hey, Brian, there's an animal in your pants. <laughs> okay, Blaze is a very cute dog, but enough puppy time. Back to models, like this one. Brian's wife has a thing for Camaros. Seriously. He builds Camaro models for her, but what she needs is a Camaro 12-step program. <laughs> Good thing Brian has the new workshop. He needs the extra space to display all those models. When Brian isn't building models or playing with Blaze, he likes to spend his days in Florida, where he snorkels in sarcasm. So if any of this floats your boat, subscribe to BAS Dry Dock. Morkaya. Morkaya is a channel that features outdoor lifestyle, mostly around the village of Morkaya in Artvin, Turkey. The road to Morkaya is very dangerous. Morkaya subscribers get to view these scary and dangerous mountain roads in safety. When on vacation from his work at a university in the city, he likes to spend time in communion with nature. As long as there are no wolves, <laughs> you should check out those videos. This channel isn't just about driving mountain roads. Other aspects of outdoor lifestyle are featured. For instance, dancing in trees. <laughs> okay, okay. He isn't dancing in the tree. There are product reviews for outdoor fun and survival, camping gear, and even hotel reviews. He is exploring the outdoors sometimes by bike, Sometimes by motorcycle, sometimes with family, and sometimes alone. The first video I saw, he was camping in the car with his children on a very cold night. And I said, aww, so sweet. The children join the camping fun in warmer weather. You're never too young to learn something new. Morkaya is filled with moments of fun and meditation. A little new mixed with the old. You may also see him in your comment section because he watches your videos also. I've seen him. Hey, you have to do something in the tent when camping, right? Check out Markaya. Walsh Farms. Walsh Farms is doing all sorts of fun stuff on YouTube. From building sheds to garden beds. <laughs> that rhymed. Fun trips and racing for slips. Charlie Daniels wrote that song, you know, his famous one about Walsh Farms. <laughs> he took the subscribers to the Georgia Pecan Festival. Um, Tony? Why does that pecan look like poo? Oh my gosh, it's a poo con. <laughs> it's all fun and games, and then Tony live streams his number two. <laughs> it says so right there. See Walsh Farms? This is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> okay, okay. Besides pecans and number two, 
Walsh Farms knows their way around the kitchen and food preservation. Watch how they turn this innocent bowl of blackberries into a sheep placenta. Goodness. Thanks to all you YouTubers with sheep videos, I now know what sheep placenta looks like. Okay, what else are they into? Walsh Farms loves tractor and truck pools. They also plant peanuts and rebar. And then there are the giveaways. Walsh Farms grows sugarcane and makes their own syrup. Remember this from Ed's attention to detail? Homemade sugarcane, homemade sugarcane, homemade so, sugarcane. Yeah, I, I did kind of forget to tell you about, I forgot to tell you about the syrup. It is homemade. Walsh Farms sent us a wonderful bottle of homemade sugarcane syrup. They are growing so much food over there that you really just need to go check it out for yourself. Also, congratulations on 1,000 subscribers! Don't miss an upload of Walsh Farms, y'all. Scale models, sarcasm, and ships. Hiking, camping, and outdoor fun. Homesteading, pecans, and sugarcane paradise. Are these your people?